Hey guys and welcome to another Fitbit Quickie. On this one we are going to take a look at the Buildcraft waterproof pipes. On the last one we took a look at the item transport pipes. So uh, in the waterproof pipes there are wooden, uh, cobblestone waterproof pipe, uh, stone, iron, gold, emerald, sandstone and void. Let's first take a look at how you can craft these. So to to craft this, you need a cactus cactus green, and uh, of course you can get this to by uh, smelting a cactus, and you craft these into pipe water waterproofs like that, and you take a normal transport pipe and you add one uh, pipe waterproof and you get one waterproofed pipe, and this is same for every one of these. Uh, iron, gold, emerald, sandstone, and void. And what this does or do uh, is the same thing, or, or, or how this work is is same as the ones, uh, the item transport ones. So I'm not going to go through them uh, as extinct uh, as uh, detailed <laughs> but uh, so you need uh, you uh, use the water water wooden waterproof pipe to draw out items from a machine that uh, delivers water or has water so one example could be a a oil refinery uh, where you uh, turn oil into fuel and you can pipe these uh, or deliver these the uh, liquid using these into another machine for example an engine every single one of these works similar to the ones that uh, doesn't or, or transport the items so I'm not going to go through them uh, as detailed. Uh, you can watch watch the uh, previous video to find out what each one of these does. Okay, so let's next take a look at the conductive pipes. Hey guys and welcome to another Fitbit Quickie. On this one we are going to take a look at the Buildcraft waterproof pipes. On the last one we took a look at the item transport pipes. So uh, in the waterproof pipes there are wooden, uh, cobblestone waterproof pipe, uh, stone, iron, gold, emerald, sandstone and void. Let's first take a look at how you can craft these. So to uh, to craft these you need a cactus, cactus green and uh, of course you can get this to by uh, smelting a cactus and you craft these into pipe water waterproofs like that and you take a normal transport pipe and you add one uh, pipe waterproof and you get one waterproof pipe and this is same for every one of these uh, iron gold emerald sandstone and void and what this does or do uh, is the same thing or, or, or how this work is the same as the ones uh, the item transport ones so I'm not going to go through them uh, as extinct uh, as uh, detailed <laughs> but uh, so you need uh, you uh, use the water water wooden waterproof pipe to draw out items from a machine that uh, delivers water or has water. So one example could be a a oil refinery uh, where you uh, turn oil into fuel, and you can pipe these uh, or deliver these the uh, liquid using these into another machine for example an engine 
every single one of these works similar to the ones that uh, doesn't or, or transport the items. So I'm not going to go through them uh, as detailed. Uh, you can watch watch the uh, previous video to find out what each one of these does. Okay, so let's next take a look at the conductive pipes. We lose 1% uh, of the energy each block it will travel. The gold one will lose only 0.01% of the distance of, of, of each block it travels. So the golden one is uh, much better but, but also it's a bit exp more expensive than the stone one. Uh, and another re reason uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, th that was uh, that was uh, yeah. The golden conductive pipes, the stone conductive pipe doesn't have an energy limit, but the golden one does. So it's a thousand uh, megajoules, but uh, it's really hard to get, and uh, it only happens if there's a loop in your system and uh, something feeds constant MJs into this, and these will explode the pipes if that happens. So that was the uh, waterproof pipes and the conductive pipes. On the next one we are going to take a look at the machines that go with these or that you can connect with these uh, pipes. So thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you on the next one.